Hello everybody. In this video, I'll be doing my full face routine. I did a face routine uh, video before with Everyday Minerals products. And in this video, I'm gonna mm, do my makeup with liquid um, foundation and uh, I'm gonna do my eye makeup too. So, if you are interested, keep watching. First of all, I'm gonna start with concealing the problemed areas on my face. I'm gonna use this color for my face imperfections because the other one is too light and I'm gonna use this everyday minerals um, eyeshadow brush but I use this for um, cream concealer okay, I have a mirror here so I'll be looking down there Okay, I think I'm done with this concealer. The next step is putting on foundation. And the foundation that I'm gonna use is Maybelline's Wonder Finish Makeup. Okay, I'm taking that much. It may look like a lot, but it's very runny, so. Okay, I'm gonna use this brush by e.l.f. to apply this runny foundation. And taking about that much and applying it to my cheek like this in padding motions I kind of stipple it more than swirling to the other cheek what I like about this foundation is you can build it up so if you feel like one coat is not enough you can always put more some little, little on my chin just a little bit on my nose okay just too little a little bit more on my forehead and whatever left on my hand is I'm taking and applying on my neck my face is pretty much covered the next step is concealing my under eyes and i'm gonna use this benefits erase paste but i find this color very dark for my under eyes so i kind of mix it with another product and applying it on my under eye in dots I'm gonna take this Flormar per Perfect Coverage Concealer in number 02 Ivory again. I apply it on the Benefit one. Not very much. Well, it looks much. But I hope it won't be that much. And I'm gonna apply that with my Coastal Scents Deluxe Crease Brush. I'm gonna mix these two concealers to create a natural color. Sorry. So my under eye circles are pretty much covered. And as you can see, I have pretty dark eyelids. I'm gonna be using this um, lem Lemonade by Benefit. Okay, I'm applying it to all over my eyelid lightly. I don't want to use too much because it creases. You can see and tell the difference, I hope. Now I'm gonna set my um, foundation with my favorite powder, powder of all time, Ketrina Lace number no. five, and I'm applying my powder with Elf's complexion brush. So after I set my powder, I'm gonna set my under eye concealer. For this, I'm using Max. Mineralized Skin Finish Natural. I really like this powder. Okay, I'm gonna apply this powder with my 
Coastal Sands No Name brush. It's just a big fluffy brush. So I'm taking some and applying it under my eye. And some on my eye too. Okay, so my face is done. Now I'm gonna start contouring and I'm gonna apply a blush. For this, I'm gonna use this e.l.f. Uh, warm bronzer and the same e.l.f. complexion brush. Oops. Apply these two dark parts together and kind of shake it and apply right here. Okay, some more to my temple, to my forehead and temple to create a shadow to make my face look thinner. Okay, I'm done with contouring my face. Now it's time for my nose and I'm gonna use this brush again. I'm gonna clean it on the back of my hand and again the same dark sides kind of swirl the brush there tap the axis and contour my nose I'm done with bronzer part and now I'm gonna use the blush I want to use the pink part of this because I really like the color and I think it looks pretty natural on the skin. I'm gonna use this brush by Seville. Just a simple blush brush. I'm gonna apply it on my cheeks. Okay, and after I apply blush, it's time for highlight. And for highlight, I'm using this too. Okay, and kind of C motion here and here too. I build this uh, highlighter up, moving on the eyes. Okay, I zoomed a little bit so you can see um, better. I'm gonna use this NYX Tan Eyeshadow Palette for the runway collection in champagne and caviar. First, I'm gonna apply this taupey color all over my lid with my elf eyeshadow brush okay I I'm gonna look at my mirror here I'm applying it pretty much all over after that I'm gonna apply this color on my crease with Elf's blending brush. Something bad about these eyeshadows, um, they tend to fall out a lot. I really like the colors but they fall out so much. Okay, applying it to my V and I'm gonna blend it with a clean brush. This is um, eyeshadow blender by the body shop okay I'm gonna smooth the outer corner line and I'm gonna blend the D eyeshadow like this so after that I'm gonna take the same elf brush again and I'm gonna put it in this cold matte dark brown just a little bit I'm gonna dab the brush very softly and apply it on my outer V okay and again the same body shop brush I'm gonna blend it more like this so after 
this I'm gonna use this pink light pink with my elf brush again for highlighting the brow bone so and after that I'm gonna apply some more um, powder to my under eye to erase that mess I hate messy eyeshadows and after I'm done with putting on eyeshadow I'm gonna highlight the inner corner for this I'm using my Flormar palette and number 82 and I'm gonna use this beautiful color Now I'm moving on eyeliner. I'm using L'Oreal's Liner Intense Liquid Eyeliner. I like using, I like starting from the outer cor corner and to go to inner corner. For me it works the best. If you want you can make it thicker and longer. You can have, you can tell that I have pretty low um, eyelids, unfortunately. So sometimes it doesn't look that good. Okay, I suggest you to um, curl your eyelashes, but since I've lost my eyelash curler, and the other one that I order is didn't arrive yet, so I, I won't be able to curl my eyelashes. I'm gonna use my L'Oreal Voluminous Mascara. And I'm gonna put it on. Like this. No mascara. I'm gonna fill my eyebrows in and for this I'm gonna be using the Coastal Sense brush and Avon's Espresso eyeshadow like this and lastly I'm gonna put on lipstick and I'm gonna use Yves Saint Laurent's Rouge Volapte number two So guys, this is my face routine and I hope that you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching and I will talk to you later. Bye.